In this how-to video, I'm going to show you how to create a new website in IIS Manager. So the first thing we're going to want to do is to open up Internet Information Services Manager. And you get there by going Start, Administrative Tools, and then IIS. From here, we will expand our server name, Sites, and then we'll see the default website that's still there. And from here, we're going to want to right-click and add a new website. So it's going to find ask us where the physical path is to this new website. So we're going to have to make sure that the path exists for where we want to go. So we'll go to our computer, double click on the C drive, and I'm going to choose the INET pub folder, although you can choose anything you want. We will right click, choose a new folder, call it test one. Our original website is the test folder where our default test.html document is. So we're going to go ahead and call the site name test1 physical path. It's going to be in INET pub and then test1. And our connect as, by default, it's going to use the iUser for anonymous access. And we need to set our binding up. Since we know the first website is test.com, this website is going to be test1.com. If we only have one, one website, we can leave this blank. But if you're going to have multiple websites that are pointing to the same IP address, in this case we only have one IP address, then you have to have a different host name for each one. You can also check HTTPS instead of just regular HTTP. When you're done, click OK. And we now see our test one website.